everyone, it's Steffi here and today I'm here with um, a decor video. Um, so recently I've been purchasing a lot of different home decor pieces. For those of you who don't know, I'm moving to another city in August, mid-August. Um, it's been very exciting because it's the first time I'm moving um, out on my own. I think I did a little too much shopping. Um, I'm very excited to share the pieces with you, so let's get started. So the first thing I have here is this beautiful gold lamp. Um, I got this at Walmart. It's originally about $40. I got it on sale for about $20. I think the sale is still going on. Um, so recently Walmart's just been clearing a lot of home decor pieces. And I've been wanting a gold lamp, table lamp for my table for a while. And I think it's very pretty. Um, so there's a cable that you turn it on from here. I would have wished the turn on button was over here, but that's okay. Um, I can easily just bring the wire over to the side of my table so that it's um, easy to turn on and off. I really like the shade of gold. I thought it was a great steal because um, it was basically half price. I love gold and I love pink and I decided to use those two colors as my main color. So the next thing I got is this beautiful pillow I got from H&M. Uh, it says, love more, dream big, and I'm all about inspirational quotes. Um, so I loved it, and also it's gold. Cool. This pillow was very inexpensive. It was about, um, I think $7.99 for the actual pillow, and then the pillowcase was on sale for about $5. I love that H&M has a lot of different pillowcases that you can switch out, and they always go with the trend. So I bought this one during Christmas. Um, but they have a lot of very um, spring colors right now going on, very pink, very pastel -y. Um Yeah, so I love this because um, I can always go back to H&M and switch out the pillowcase when it's a different season. I find that when I go to places like HomeSense, the pillows are usually more expensive and you can't switch it out, so it's permanent. Um, this was also a very good size. They have a bigger size, but I chose the smaller size. The next item I have here is this pet food container that I got from HomeSense. It was about $12. Uh, it's for Bella's food. Bella's a very small dog, so she, this is the perfect size for her food um, to keep on the kitchen counter. What I also love about this container is that you have a handle on top, but you also have a nice grip over here. I found this very easy for us because we used to just keep her dog food inside the original uh, packaging and it would be a hassle because the bag would start ripping and everything. So I wanted to invest in a better piece to keep her dog food. So this one was cute and it was also functional. Also, how can you not love this shade of pink? The next piece I have here is a little cupcake holder that I got also from HomeSense. It was about like eight dollars. Um, I love this because obviously it's gold and it has this beautiful print pattern on it. I would love to put this on my kitchen counter just to put some snacks on it or something. Um, but I don't know. I don't know where I'll put it yet. The next thing I have here is this beautiful fake flower. Um, I don't know about you, but I can never afford flowers every day. So I usually buy fake flowers because it makes the room have a pop of color and also uh, gives it a more homely feel. So I got this one from HomeSense. It was about $11. I love this color and the shade of pink with a little bit of a touch of orange that gives it a more warm tone. When I first saw these come out, which was a few years ago, I thought it was super cool that they made the water look like so realistic. Uh, the branches are not as realistic, but it's been covered by this glass container to kind of hide it. Uh, I think this will go on my desk along with my gold lamp. The next thing I have here is this beautiful pink coral tray. I got this from HomeSense and I think it was about $7 as well. It's a beautiful gold marble effect on here um, which ties in with my gold lamp and also the flowers that I showed earlier. So I thought this would be a perfect uh, piece to tie both pieces together. Uh, and put on top of my desk and maybe just put little paper clips, um, uh, push pins, any, anything that's small onto here in a little container and I just thought that would look very cute. The next item I have here is this beautiful pink cup. I got this at HomeSense for about $4. Uh, it also has a beautiful love logo inside. 
it's just so pretty I had to get it. Uh, I love that it has the different tones of pinks. I'm excited about the next item. So I've been searching forever for coasters. Uh, it's just been so hard to find any coasters that are not too expensive. I've been looking everywhere, Indigo, Chapters, Ikea, and I just couldn't find anything that I liked and was also not too pricey. So I finally came across these beautiful white marble coasters that came in a pack of four for above $13 at HomeSense. It's just so beautiful to look at and it's also very functional. And it also has the four little foam pieces to sit on your table. So I'll probably put one on my desk and then the rest will go in the living room. So while I was going around Dollarama, I found this beautiful notebook that I thought it would tie really well in with my decor on my desk. So I'm going to have this on my desk as well. This is a beautiful tone of that same coral pink that we've been seeing throughout my haul with the gold edition to tie everything together um, and I think it will work very well on my desk. The last piece I have here is this beautiful inspirational quote frame um, that says smiles are always in fashion. So I basically DIY'd this and it's super easy. You just buy a bunch of um, metallic sharpie markers. I use the gold one but there's always copper and silver and you just make your text and then you go over it with um, your gold or whatever color you're using and then you frame it and this frame is super inexpensive just from Dollarama and I would just want to put this on my desk uh, currently it's just on my fireplace <laughs> it's very beautiful the next two items are not really uh, decor pieces but they're books cookbooks specifically so I have this cookie book which I love and it is a gift uh, Christmas version but there's a lot of recipes in here that are not specific for Christmas. Um, I recently just made the Chinese almond cookie and it tastes really good and I just love cooking so I think in the future uh, when I get my own place on the weekends I probably just cook a bunch of cookies and sweets. Also, this book was only about $5. It was in the indigo sales section. Usually in cookbooks or anything like that, I usually only find about one or two recipes I want to do. But this one I found a lot, so I'm very excited about that. The next book I have here is this basic women's weekly cookbook. I never cook like ever, so this is great for me. It talks about the basics. And what I love about this book is that it gives you a basic recipe and then it shows you variations on how to create uh, different things. For example, they tell you how to create the basic uh, tomato sauce for pasta and then they tell you how to make the marinara sauce or garlic version of it. So I love that and I love that it has a bunch of marinades as well for meats because I don't know how to marinate meat. And I love how it's a very easy to read book. It has a lot of pictures. I love that it also has very beautiful design and graphically. Uh, so it's a very easy to read book and it was only $15 again at the sales section so I love it. So that's the end of the haul. I hope you liked it and enjoyed my video. Uh, please remember to subscribe and comment and like. Uh, I'll be posting more of these videos because I will be doing a lot more shopping in the future. When I move, I'll also be posting uh, the process on my other channel, my vlog channel. So be sure to check out that channel as well. Thanks for watching and talk to you later. Bye!